Hey guys and welcome back to another video. Today's video is going to be the third installment of requests and we're going to be installing Addaway which is kind of like the the app that adds entries to your host file to block ads essentially. It's free and open source and available on the Fdroid website and today we're going to install this and all you need is a rooted phone. So to kick things off we're going to go and double check in the settings that we can install apps from unknown sources. So you can go to the settings and scroll down to security and then make sure that uh, unknown sources are checked. Once you've done that you can go back to the first link in the description so you can do this all from your phone and basically what you want to do is head over to the download which is down here. Download APK only 5.4 megabytes and just save it to your device. You can wait while that finishes downloading, which should be now. And all you need to do is tap on it, install it, which shouldn't take too long either, and we will go ahead and have a look at some before and after. Now, one thing that may be a little bit concerning about this is that if you want to use AdFly or something like that, I don't think it redirects there, or if there are too many redirects through advertising you know, those trackers and all that, it won't work either. So we're going to hit done and we're going to go to a website such as Android Authorities is something I have here. We have ads at the top, in the middle, and yeah, pretty much throughout the whole thing. So we're going to open up uh, Add Away right there. And we're going to grant the super user access. And we're going to tap on download files and apply ad blocking. And that will kind of merge all these uh, files here together. And we're done, okay. So we should reboot our phone. So I'm going to tap no and we'll just take a look at and see if it did anything. I'm going to refresh. And if not, all you've got to do is restart your phone and you shouldn't be seeing any more advertisements. Well, it looks like we didn't have to. You can see our top one's gone. And if we scroll through, there aren't any advertisements. And I think if we try to go to AdFly or something like that. Is ad.f... adf.ly. It just won't connect. So yeah, it does get rid of ads. We can, we can just go back. You can see there are gaps for it, but then it should move itself up. Oh no. Maybe they just didn't load up at the time. No, nope, but it looks like it's no ads again. Well, there we go. That's how you install and use Ad Away on your Android device. And of course, you can uh, apply different filters here for ad blocking and also disable ad blocking uh, overall. So we can have lists here. We can open our source our host file. And we can check our sources here, and you can also add uh, manual ones there. And so that's it for this video. Thank you guys for watching. And if you have any more requests, of course, leave them down in the comments below. And also if you have any questions. So far, we have one more request, or two more. One about kernel profiles, and one about accessing TWRP on Android N. So those should be coming up relatively soon, hopefully. So thank you guys for watching, and I'll talk to you in the next one.